Good morning, good morning, good morning. You know it's kind of early, but you know, we just have to come adjust the nation because you know, a photo hype from the people for the people. Um, may I wonder if the Jamaican citizens, people living in Jamaica, people born in Jamaica, people who connected to Jamaica, who have family and friends and relatives in Jamaica, where every decision that the government makes in Jamaica affect you in some way, shape or form. Now, who no may talk to this man? See? So, who no realize now so the government take on a few idiot or not? Because, you know, you have some people like we were awake and we see things before it happened. And then you have the people them where Oh, sleep a box me. And you have the people them where realize what happened while it happened. Then you have the people them where all when it happened, them still I tell themselves, say, it now happened. Now, don't know who thoroughly remember before the elections, Futa Ibe said, do not, I repeat, do not vote for Andrew Wellness. I said it. All right, you know, listen to me. Because when you say Futa chat too much, when you go against what Futa say, and give him a landslide victory because of clerks and state show. Because or Jamaica Labour Party, the MPLI artists, them for perform at them rally and you know music of the healing of the nation and the artists, them people of the artists, they more than politicians. So Jamaica Labour Party they have the right entertainment package and the right social media PR. That's why one the election is not um legislation and policies and future plans on them something to see it was fanfare that won the election and me CBN the fanfare you understand what I mean I say so that's why I was able to tell the people them don't do it anyway cut long story short people them gay honorable bro got a landslide victory meaning them win majority seats in Jamaica. That means we are living in a labor right country. Whether you are PNP or not, is the Jamaica Labor Party government easier government? And I'll do me never want Andrew win. Andrew Olness is my Prime Minister. Big up Debo. And that's something we have to live with for the next three and a half years or three years. Now, this big C, this so-called disease, we are going around, where make them implicate all kind of madness spawn. And some people out there, when we speak of logics and truth, always try to denounce what we are saying. About two weeks ago, I said to the people, I'm saying, if you got locked down the country for three days, open it for four days, and lock it down back for three days, how, what are the bases, which scientific evidence you have, what you have as proof, you say, them three days they were you locked down the country, the big C is more critical than the four day where you go open. Cause the day them they right beside one another. So oh it no see if you go outside Sunday, Monday and Tuesday. But it see if you go out there Wednesday, Thursday, Friday and Saturday. Then you lock down back Sunday. Oh what kind of tape measure you have where you measure the days them?
no one know what kind of telescope or testoscope or thermometer what you use, we don't know what you use but what do you use to analyze what days to lock down and what days to open I don't say you know, lock down the place you know, to protect the efforts you know, to protect the people you know. but explain to me the logic of the lockdown how how, how we are say makes sense me really really because me, me search and me look and me cannot find the reason why I got the day them they beside one another me, 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 me not understand sorry the day them decide one another you know one day running to the next day, you know. So, oh, you know which... Ah. <laughs> which day COVID... Oh, I don't want to say it. Because I don't want them black my video. Which day the big C more aggressive and which day it more subtle? Because obviously, you must have locked down the country upon the day them when it most aggressive. So, my question is, how do you choose the days that the big C is more aggressive? That are my question. I that you that really like no. When you oh you choose, oh you and the the MOH, uh Mr. Christopher Tufton and all the other people them, where the people them for idiot. What one of measures of knowing the danger days from the weaker days, which day more dangerous, so we have to lock it down, and which day more calm? Because me never know, say, the big C, I call people and I tell people when it got more rampant from when it got more calm. Now that would I like no, Because if one of this disease is communicating so well, one is supposed to can tell with them. When it are gonna leave, you understand? Only supposed to can't tell you then what the real problem because the vaccine. Oh man, I shouldn't have said that. Cause the big V cannot help to deter the disease. No, them said them they are one thing now named Delta variant. No people I don't think gonna understand it. The the V cannot stop the D. The V will not cannot do nothing at all to the delta. If we don't understand. The V will not take for so called big C has no effect on the big D when I open that ear message when it is made for the big C see it cannot have any effect on the D so if you go take the joke for the big C them I gotta tell you now say you have to get something else for the big D and you know how much variants they are them have over 300 and variant you know so you gotta have Delta you gotta have American Airlines you gotta have Southwest you have to go have Fly Jamaica you have to have Cayman variant you have to have Arkaka and a Delta alone so my thing is to these people who feel so special if you go get the big V zine I say yes I'm fully V I'm fully V what I go do when I'm telling about the Delta and the Southwest and the Norwegian and the JetBlue and the all different kind of something what I go do because I want more lead to the next, you know. 
This has nothing to do with the big C. You know? The V not have nothing to do with the C. You know? Only need to start pay attention. You know? There's a 98.6% recovery rate from the C. So it better you not take the experimental drug there, the nano drug there, where they might get because it's not a V. They won't go tell you say a V. But if you listen to the experts and do your research, it cannot be classified as a V. You understand? It is not a V. So when you hear them, I call it V. Alright, first thing on the people at the round. See the news, yeah. Um, well, we're looking to implement that you have to take the V to go back to school. Them never say it is implemented, you know. Prince Diamond, big up yourself, you buy badges. Them never say. It implemented in a way to people in a fear, them not listen. Them say we are looking to do that. That means them are plan. So them are throw the fear factor out there. No. Because you have school, you run go take the joke. Run go take the joke out of fear. Carry your picnic go take the joke out of fear. Well, if you just sit back. Relax and oppose an object and make the objecting numbers nougher than the promoting numbers. Because they cannot force you. It's against the law to force you to do this thing. But they use word play power. No? We are looking to hear that, you know? Mandate this for schools. Unonglier mandate this for school. That's all in the ear. Uno listen to the words then before and after. That's why so much I wanna run go suicide on yourself. Out of fear. Stop listen to the danger words them alone. Listen what he said before and after the word mandatory and the word V, the V word. Listen what he said before and after. Cause them a drive fear uno uno and then uno willingly make them mission come through cause you run go take this thing here. First thing more want people for understand. Because none of these V's were approved by the real approval agencies them keep changing them them keep adding things to them kind of regulation of them the ingredients them are them are put queen bella big up yourself the the ingredients them are them are putting the change a seven ban ingredients them have in them now you know? that's why them so wicked and i kill people now you know? and i kill people even wicked you know? because nobody never approved them so no, them never had a regulatory observation. You notice say, all of the V them. When you see them in the back of them look like water. And one million ingredients in there all metal in it. And you can't see it. So oh no. You are gonna make your prime minister or your president or your minister of health tell you say them take the vax. When me I say that man you them take the V when they show you one buckle with clear something looking like water it's called a camouflage now when them tell us okay we have seven ingredients in there how do you or your prime minister or your president or your minister of health knows that there's only that amount of ingredient in there how Somebody say 
Pfizer is FDA approved. Pfizer is FDA approved for certain emergency situation. It's not approved to give the whole world. So when you hear approved, also read what is it approved for. It not approved for guac and give everybody. No. After emergency situation towards certain behavior. Not for everybody. So, I'm going to pay attention to the word play. What am I use a beat in a word play? Can I listen too quick? I don't want to listen too quick. I don't want to listen everything. I don't want to listen everything. Not in English. Speak up yourself. Zine, it doesn't matter if you're a nurse, my dear. Saying you're a nurse doesn't mean you're right and I am wrong. Because most of you nurse don't know anything about cells, nanotechnology, minerals, electrons, and all those things. Let me add you. I'll see if you can name me. The top 10 minerals in other body. I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go live with that. I could get technical now. I could get real technical. Come here, nurse. But I'm sure I know me know Wally. I'm gonna challenge any nurse if you come tell me so they know about this V business. Can even a doctor then they know much less a nurse then. See, you can't join, you decline. So don't be typing if you can't step up to the plate and have a sensible reasoning. Because because you're a nurse does not mean you know anything about vaccines. You're me tired for them black me. <laughs> so, so sweet. So sweet. Go in the bathroom. And just take five minutes and educate you for five minutes and go back. Come, I can guarantee you. You don't know all the ingredients in the, in the, in the, in the, in the, vac in the V. First thing, you're not a lab technician that put things under microscope and separate and comb through. Um, I see what our ingredients in there. You are a nurse. So you only administer what is given to you to administer. You know, do the deeper work. Because even the scientists are limited to what they can research and what they can do. You understand what I mean, sir? So, I say all of that now. Me type, me say all of that now. If you say this. Our problem in Jamaica, as according to Bro God, is this big disease that's going rampant and the numbers are going through the roof, right? Okay. So, today is a no movement day, right? Absolutely no movement. The one ship are docked today from international waters. And them break the rules of no movement and allow the tourists from, I think, 8.30 in the morning to 4.30 in the evening to be able to um, go and have fun and enjoy themselves. So when them leave now, I read them come with Delta or JetBlue or American Airlines and left it down there. We, the corner shop people, and the people may have buy a pound of chicken back and two in a mackerel and big chilla aisle are going to be blamed for whatever it is that came off the ocean with these people and left it at Jamaica. And that's all gone. Thank you, Queen of Visual.
No, me just a ask you know, if you might blame the Karnasha people, them now, when them come with some new variant, whether it be Delta, JetBlue, Southwest, whatever it is, them come with. Because anybody know about disease and um, the little thing, them are traveling sick people. They travel on the ocean. They travel in hurricanes, storms, rain, breeze, and them thing. They travel. That's how those things travel. They are airborne. Remember, let me tell you, I said a big V, are airborne, right? So, when you have a cruise liner, a travel, somebody say, sir, are you in Jamaica? So why is Jamaica your problem? And add that to the life, say for this wife. Yeah. Oh, she not allowed to join life? Why? Uh. Anyway, so when you have a cruise line you know, with thousands of people you now, um, forward from wherever it's forward in from to Jamaica, unload in Jamaica, people them go party all boat and enjoy the beach and the something them and let off for them and let off in the water. The water them run going to some different areas. Cause remember beach and river and and they sit there, run to different places. And whatever them let off, them gone with a left boy as it airborne. Who them are going to blame for that? Hmm? Who them are blame for that? I can't ask people, bro, God, I can going to blame for that. The people them are buy chicken back. And the people them are buy big July. Hmm? Now, ask you know, the diet is labor right now. I don't know, see nothing wrong with that style. I don't know, see nothing wrong with that style. So, obviously, this means I want to pay attention to the words that I'm going to say. I want to pay attention to the words that we may have to say right now. Clearly, the big C is not the problem. Peace Panda action here yeah, taken by the government today on a no movement day in Jamaica. We now know that the facade about this big C is not the real reason why none of this is happening. You want me to tell you what I think is really happening? They are plunging the poorer class into more poverty. And a selected amount of people in Jamaica have increased their wealth by 200 or more percent since this so-called pandemic. Understand what me just saying. Understand what me just said. The poorer class has been plunged into way more death than where they mean in and a selected amount of people in Jamaica has increased their wealth 